Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we got Family Guy Best Moments number 6. This is not number 6. This is like probably like number 20, 30, fucking who knows how many times I've done this uh, Family Guy on the channel. But um, yeah man, we all love fucking Family Guy. If you're here, you probably love Family Guy. So, let's fucking get it. Alright, Mr. Quagmire, I understand you have the hiccups. <laughs> now, it says here on your chart, you've tried boo. <laughs> Outside of that, the best way to treat hiccups is through hypnosis. Yeah, hypnosis <laughs> helps with all sorts of stuff. This guy even helped me recover a traumatic repressed memory. One front row ticket for Nickelback, please. The music <laughs> was great, but I split my black jeans during photograph. The bouncers had to carry me out with a napkin over my ass. <laughs> Magic 8-Ball, <eight> <laughs> what's the best email provider? Outlook good. Interesting. He's not raving about it, but it's a solid choice. Let's go, Peter. Time for church. Mom said they're gonna serve Chewy Chips Ahoy at coffee hour. Lois, church? Who am I supposed to worship? Jesus? This is my God now. <laughs> Watch your mouth, Peter. Sorry, Lois, but my religion is now the eight ball. Magic eight ball? Is the Fox Network sustainable in this new streaming world? <laughs> no! No! <gasps> Kim, what's wrong? A black ball went to waste. <laughs> Mom, you won't believe what happened. You know, you know Kim Kardashian ain't letting no black balls go to waste, man. Ben, your video went viral. <gasps> oh, does that mean Circuit City's back? No, it means your ICU video really connected with people. You're helping people who feel unseen, Mom, like me. You're everywhere. Okay, so what am I supposed to do now? Make another video. Hi, Lois. I didn't get a monkey. Off to see Bananarama. Bye. <laughs> well, it's not what I thought it was going to be either. We came to ask if there's anything we can do to get Chris back in the school. I I'm afraid we can't do that. Oh, I think you can. I think you can do that and a whole lot more. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, what the f Fuck. I don't think I've ever seen that. What the fuck? We came to ask if there's anything we can do to get Chris back in the school. I I'm afraid we can't do that. Oh, I think you can. I think you can do that and a whole lot more. Oh my god. That is not what a testicle is supposed to look like. Has a doctor seen this? What are you gonna do? Charge me with smoking? Mr. Griffin, I'm afraid you have testicular cancer. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do. Oh, I think maybe there is. Oh. If you keep doing that, you're gonna pop it. We should get some food in you, mister. You hardly ate any of that cereal I smashed on your mouth yesterday. <gasps> Brian? Oh, hey. What the hell are you doing? Oh, I've been kind of using Rupert as a chew toy. Chewing him with your crotch? Hey, dogs like humping stuffed animals. What can I say? Besides, you said I could have Rupert. He is just... My man, my man just walked into the kitchen and in in Brian's fucking Rupert. What the fuck? But you liked Oscar better anyway. Well, I just changed my mind. And you knew Rupert's a dude, right? You gay lord. I just feel bad they stole your candy. Well, now I know how Peter feels when Mort steals his paper. Come on, that's right, you bastard. Stop right there. Yeah, give me the paper! No! No, don't hurt me, you bastard! Mort, give me the paper! No, I'm reading it in here. <laughs> you can have the real estate section. It's for schmucks anyway. Hey, if you want something, you've got to go for it. Just like the fat man did when he changed his name. I'm looking for a Peter Ferrari. Obviously, that's me. Yes. There's a soiled pair of Ferrari underwear in the men's room trash. Who took them out of the sink? They were soaking! Sir, I can't park this. There's diarrhea all over the front seat of your PT Cruiser. Oh, Nick Jonas is so... Oh, man, don't even have the Ferrari. You got a PT Cruiser. And he shit himself in there. Yeah? Hello, fight! Ow, you bastard! That's a real shit. Sorry, Lois. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie have come by to shop for children. Hey, Angie, 
How about this one? Hold up the color swatch. I want to see if it goes with the bathroom. We've got AIDS, and we want to pass the AIDS on to you. Just listen to these satisfied customers. I want AIDS. I've secretly had AIDS for years, but no one at work knows. You can't even tell I have AIDS. I gave AIDS to my partner. Now I have AIDS. Our AIDS are so durable. It's just a commercial for AIDS? Well, you'll be passing them on to your children. And with our low, low prices, there's never been an easier time to get AIDS. So come on down to the Hearing Warehouse. Serving San Francisco homosexuals since 1981 or right around there. They did not have to do them like that, bruh. They were talking about AIDS. Hi, you fellas. Mighty nice to see you. Hey, a black guy. Get him. Now hold on. Before you get all excited, I'm going to drop a little knowledge on y'all. Your hatred of me and those like me is just a manifestation of your own feelings of frustration and inadequacy with regard to your personal status in an evolving and increasingly stratified economic and social landscape, you understand? Jesus, this is fucking Jaden Smith when he's 40, bro. Gosh, I never thought about it that way. Yeah, nobody's ever taken the time to explain it to us. Sir, we can't offer a strong enough apology. Is there anything we can do to make it up to you? You already have. You've learned something. Well, Lois, I'm glad you're not blind anymore. Oh, me too. I just wish I'd handled it better. Hey, at least you got to go to Hollywood. Burbank. What's the difference? Burbank. Uh, oh, boy, I'll show you. Want to get your car washed by a former Nickelodeon star? Want to take an improv class from an instructor you have to drive home after? You can, <laughs> in Burbank. Buy a house with a second floor no one got permits for, and then watch the 98-degree winter nights tick by through rusty bars on your windows. Share a duplex with that guy from that thing. Pay L.A. prices for <laughs> Orlando amenities in Burbank. Yikes. Now imagine the man is this baster. And the woman is this turkey. The man takes his baster and very slowly places it in the turkey. Ew! Does the baster have to go into the dirty, smelly turkey? Why can't it just be with another nice, clean baster? Still, we've been gay his whole life, man. That's just how he wants. He wants the tip, tip. He wants to do a little, a little sword fight. Yeah. The bride and groom have written their own vows. Oh no. Rachel, <laughs> I love you. And today we merge our lives, our hearts, and our fraudulent home businesses. More. May my plant of fasciitis act like the roots for our tree of love. We will reshape our lives together, just as socks reshape my calves daily. I am so happy to be merging the napkins in my pockets with the napkins in your pockets. Rachel, what the fuck? With you by my side, there is no Christmas display that I can't sue the city over. I vow to keep you nourished by filling our home with the worst wine in the world and preparing potatoes and applesauce, just like nobody. And I <sighs> vow to adorn our walls with only brown art from the 70s. Mort, we're two peas in a pod. We just go together. You are the plastic covering to my furniture. And you are the little spit bubble in the corner of my mouth. Oh, Mort, what the fuck? You are my forever person. Oh. That was not cute. It's fucking gross. Peter, what are you doing? You used to some Where, coke. You know how you told me to give up the 80s and find a whole different decade to be into? No, that's not what well, I... Well, I'm doing the 1920s. Not because of legal cocaine, but mostly because of legal cocaine. Time to design a very stupid <laughs> flying contraption. Cocaine plane! What's this stuff Why that looks that look like, like sand? It would work, though. It's quinoa. Nope, I don't eat foods that sound like karate words. Well, according to Food Kills, quinoa is a superfood. It's very nutritious, and it even helps keep you regular. Boys, I have a system. I poop once a week for an hour and a half. I wear a headband, and it's soaked when I'm all done. Peter, knock it off. I can't help it. My body's rejecting it. Name? Quinoa. Uh -huh. Sorry, sir. We're full. Come on in, gummy bears. Oh, you are looking fine tonight. Mm. Welcome, everyone. I hope you enjoyed your afternoon, but now it's time to get to work. On the ripping and the tearing? Even better. 
we're going to work on your relationships. After all, this isn't just a vacation, it's a couple's counseling retreat. Oh, what the hell? Sorry, Peter. We had to trick you guys or you wouldn't have come. No, you can't make me. I'll get hit with a coconut so I lose my memory of this. Ah, I remember everything. <laughs> I was abused by my dad. <laughs> oh, my God. Peter, what exactly are you worried is going to happen because of this? World War V. Peter, we've been over this. There has to be a World War Three and Four first. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's the beauty of World War V, Lois. It's so intense, it skips over the other two. Peter, it doesn't work. I have spoken! <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was a good one. I fuck with that. That was another Family Guy compilation. Um, best moments. If y'all enjoyed that, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. We are close to 100 subs, so it'd mean a lot if you guys... Um, you guys got us there man um i'm gonna try and be more consistent with the videos you know what i'm saying i've been slacking um but yeah man i appreciate y'all for watching and that's been it lady